What if I told you life might never have evolved on Earth at all? Recent studies suggest that early Earth, billions of years ago, was completely lifeless, not because life failed, but because our planet simply didn't have what it needed. You see, when Earth formed 4.5 billion years ago, it did it too fast, just 3 million years after the birth of the solar system. That speed came with a cost, it left Earth dry, no water, no carbon, no sulfur, nothing life could use. Until something huge hit us, a Mars-sized plant named Thea slammed into early Earth in a collision so massive it melted both worlds. The debris from that impact formed the moon, but scientists now think Thea gave us something far more important, the very ingredients for life. See, Thea might have carried volatile elements, water, carbon, hydrogen, and when it merged with Earth, it seeded our planet with chemistry that made oceans, air, and biology possible. And here's the wildest part, deep below Africa and the Pacific, geologists have found two giant blobs, regions of dense rock buried 2900 kilometers down. Some researchers think those could be the fossil remains of Thea, still trapped inside our planet after the impact. So maybe we aren't fully Earth at all, maybe part of us, the life, the oceans, even the moon, all came from somewhere else. If that's true, then life didn't evolve on Earth, it evolved because of a cosmic collision. And that means somewhere out there, another world might be waiting for its own Thea. This is SciSnapster, where we don't just explain science, we question existence itself. So hit that subscribe button.